Yo, what is going on guys? Bobby here and today we are going into a duo showdown victory. It's been a while and I mean Feast or Famine is by far my favorite map. By far I know a lot of you guys favorite maps and it's out so why not enjoy it. At the same time I'm also pushing for a rank 35 full. Um, with the rank 35s coming out I thought I'd challenge myself. It's a little bit late, only 5 days left of the season. But honestly it shouldn't be that hard so we're going to be trying to do that for the remainder days um but yeah what we're basically going to be doing is playing with david just going to do some rush middle strategies hopefully we can push the bull hopefully we won't come last let's hop into the games and let's see what happens okay so here we go into our first game obviously we're going to be rushing middle every game that's the only way to play on this map so here we go gonna rush mid and i think it's uncontested we should be fine okay so there is a dynamite here didn't really do much oh but the Shelly just ran over David. That's not very good. So we're going to be right over here chilling. Hopefully this Shelly gets super low. We can just come out of the bushes and get that kill. We are going to be able to. This Leon got way too close to us. So we're going to be able to pick up that kill as well. And we're just going to go off to the side over here. Get this box. And obviously we're going to have to rush middle again. These two boxes did catch my eye though. So we're going to have to go over here. One, two. We're a pretty strong bull at this point. Doing 5,000 a shot at close range. David is huge right now. Oh, I forgot it is a power-up showdown. Interesting. Okay. So we're just going to be chilling over here. David's probably going to be able to get that kill. Not sure. We're going to run close to that Piper. Almost able to pick up the kill. Unfortunately, we're not going to be able to. Still four teams left. Wow, I did not think there were this many teams. David close to that drink. He is trying to bait someone into getting it and then getting that kill. David's going to run right beside that Colt and hopefully trap it. Oh, David is getting dangerously low. He's actually going to go down. I'm just going to chill in the middle. I thought about rushing them, but I don't think it would have been a good strategy. So I'm just chilling over here right now. Trying to do my best. It looks like this team is going to go for that power-up. We got to get out of there as fast as possible. We are very, very dangerously close to dying. We're going to go down. Not looking very good. David's going to be able to get a power-up and some... Oh, no. What's happening? Okay. Oh, no. He's like glitching out or something. I have no clue what's happening to David. He's just running around like crazy right now. He's going to go down. And that is a fourth place finish. I have no clue what happened. But we're going to get fourth place. That's a minus eight. That is not a good start at all. Let's hop into the next game. Hopefully we can get back to zero and then push positive. Let's see what happens. Okay, so here we go into the second game. I decided that we're going to switch up a brawler and do a new one every time since that's way more fun. But obviously we are going to be rushing the middle every single time. Okay, we're just checking if there's no brawlers. Oh, there is a bull. Okay, that's going to be an easy kill, hopefully. David can reach him. Yep, David is able to get that kill. So we got five right now. We're looking good. There's a Piper over here. Oh, no, we're probably going to go down. Okay, we're going to trade with the Piper. David's going to be super, super strong. He's going to have eight. And as a Frank, that's really, really good. Unfortunately, we're going to be weak. We're going to have to hit a lot of shots here in order to get some kills. Hopefully, we can do so. We're going to spawn right back into the game right now. Four teams left. So again, in the same position as last time. Okay, so we got three teams left. There's probably a team... Oh, in the middle. As I say that, there's an AFK Poco just hiding in there. So that's going to be two free power-ups for us. Always remember to check those bushes. That's your lesson. So that's probably the Poco's teammate over here. Going to go for the full clip, and we're just going to be destroyed. That is another tip. <laughs> as shown, never go for the power-up. Cool. And when I mean power-up, I don't mean it has four. I mean that it drink whatever that thing is hopefully david doesn't go down before we spawn he isn't he's gonna be able to stun that poco come on let's get the colt oh no we're choking okay we're able to get the colt over there okay the poco is kind of just wiggling some team is just hiding in the bushes like guaranteed a first place spot right now we're gonna be able to pick up that kill he's gonna wait for david to spawn at least he can have one. Oh, he doesn't even get one okay i have to wait for him to fully spawn i see okay so this team only has five or at least one of the members oh it has a bolt too a pretty reckless bull. We're going to miss our super over there. David's going to be eaten up. And there goes a lot of our strength. They're going to put the turret down. This is not looking good for us at all. We're going to try and rip a super. Oh, oh, we were so close. We only needed one or two more bullets to hit for the first place. Wow, that was super, super close. Unreal. Anyways, we're going to play another brawler. Uh, let's see what we pick the next game. Let's hop into the third game and see what happens. Okay, so here we go into the next game, and this is probably the best brawler to rush middle with. We're going to be going with Shelly, and I mean, Shelly just destroys every other brawler when it comes to the rush middle strategy, and that's why we're going to be going with her. Just going to be pushing this side over here. That's going to be a really easy kill for us right off the bat. There's going to be a Primo here. Again, another super, super easy kill. Shelly just dominates in that mid. 
David's going to be able to pick up a kill. And I mean, we already have six, so we're looking really, really good. We're not using Band-Aid. You guys know we do. We strongly dislike Band-Aid over here. Oh, we're going to be able to pick that up. Oh, okay, okay. So we're still alive. We're able to chip off that Nita and kill it. Okay, we can one-shot that. That's scary that we're able to do that. We're going to be hit by that Poco Shot. David's going to go down, actually. So we're just going to be in these bushes alone. We're just going to be lurking. That Poco's looking for us, or looking for someone, I guess. We're just going to sneak up. It's going to be a really easy kill on that Nita. Where's the Poco? This Poco should go down fairly easily. We're using the stun, so we're able to get close to it straight away. And we have 11. We're just dominating so far. There's a Primo, oh, and a Leon. So we kind of counter both of them, which is pretty good. We're just going to chip away, try and get our super. Going to go a bit lower over here. Trying to get close to that Leon. We're going to be able to pick up that kill. Super, super easy. And I mean, we have 15. We're lurking in the bushes. There is no way we are losing this game. We're just going to walk around and just literally bully the rest of these players. This Primo is running as fast as he can. Oh, maybe he will be able to pick up a kill. Oh, the Leon's going to spawn right on it. I don't think there's anything the Leon can do either way. We're going to be able to like one-shot it. Really easy kill. Going to stun this Primo and there's nowhere for him to go. Going to be a really easy kill on him too. Two teams left. We have 19 power-ups. There is no way we are losing this game. We're going to pick up this as well. And this is just a scary, scary thought that we have 19 and the power-up. We're doing 2,000 damage from max range. This is unreal. That shell is just going to give up and that's going to be a dominating win. So like I said at the start of the video, or at the start of this game at least, Shelly is the strat. She overpowers everybody when it goes to rush middle. We're going to do two more. Let's pick two more brawlers. It's going to be decent at it. Let's hop into it and let's see what we get. Okay, so again, we're going to be rushing middle. This time we're going to be going with Rico. So this is going to be a little bit harder than the other times because Rico obviously is not a very good rush middle brawler. I don't think there's anyone here. I'm trying to scout it out. There's definitely a gene in here though. And a crow. Oh, we're going to go down. David should be able to clean that up though. So pretty good start. Obviously there's people on the bottom. Hopefully David has an easy time with them. He's standing still for some reason. Okay, he sees that BB. That's good. He's going to be able to pick up the kill. He's going to use his super. A pretty good prediction, but he's not going to be able to pick up the kill. Come on, let's get this Mortis. We're not going to be able to get it. Okay, the Mortis is going to back off. So we're the only one in the middle. Again, Rico is not very good at this. Oh, that's a strong gene right there. That's a very strong gene. Come on, stay alive. Just a little bit longer. No, we're going to get a last place. So I don't know what we are in the video. I think we're almost even. We're going to hop into one more. Let's see if we can go positive on the duo showdown rush middle video. Let's hop into it. One more game. Let's see what we get. Okay, so we chose Dynamite for the last one. Obviously, Dynamite is not too good at rush middle as well. But we're just trying to have fun this video. So let's see what we can do. Already a team right over here. Another Dynamite, actually. We each trade a double shot. Uh oh. Shelly right over here. David almost able to pick up the kill. Unfortunately, he wasn't able to. There should be a Shelly somewhere over here. I'm really scared that David's about to get bopped. It looks like he is going to. We're going to be able to pick up the kill, but again, that is a scary bull, so we're just going to run this way. Okay, we're able to fend that bull off. Thankfully, we're just going to get these boxes over here. Going to wait for David to spawn, obviously. Okay, David's probably going to go pick up that juice. Easy bait. We're going to be able to pick up that kill. There might be a bull in there. Okay, the bull has left. So I think we have the middle now. Okay, so we do have the mid. They are the stronger team over here, unfortunately. But we have pretty good position over it. Over them, I should say. So back in this mid, we're going to pick this up and let's see if we can just cause some havoc with it. Going to try and bait that bull. We're going to be able to, oh my god, 1,000. That's a lot of damage over there. Wow, that's unreal. So we're able to get two kills while getting that power up. We're looking like a very strong team right now. If I remember correctly, there is one up here. Oh, okay, that's a shell. We're going to stay away from that. Oh, and a power up, Colt. Very scary sights. We're just trying to stay away from these guys. So the Colt isn't going to be powered up anymore. Obviously very good for my team. Trying to get that kill on him. He's going to be coming down here. David's going to go down. This Colt's doing a, Colt's doing a pretty good job at juking over here. Okay, we're able to pick up the kill. We might go down. Oh, we're able to pick up one. Okay, only one. We have to stay alive for a little bit longer here. We're doing a good job staying alive. 
I'm gonna stay alive with 100 HP. David's gonna be able to pick up the power up and that's gonna make him a ton stronger. He's gonna be able to pick up a kill over there and we're gonna have to try our best to 1v2. We're gonna try and super that Shelly because the Shelly is the stronger one. Gonna be able to pick up the kill, gonna get the coal, and that is going to end the video with a really good dub. So I hope you guys enjoyed. That was a really fun video for me to make. I love Feast or Famine, and Duo Showdown is really starting to grow on me. Anyways, if you guys enjoyed, let me know in the comment section below, and I'll do some more Duo Showdown videos. But that's gonna be it for today. I'll be back tomorrow with another video. Peace.